Hi friends, my name is Raj and you are watching TechWhite. In this video, I will show you how to connect your Google Sites to a custom domain. So this is the website I have in Google Sites and currently I am using a free domain of Google Sites. I will show you. So right now I am using this free domain of Google Sites and this is my website interface. Now I will show you how to connect Google Sites to a custom domain. So I have a custom domain in GoDaddy. I will show you my domain name. So this is the domain name which I am going to be use healthyandcaring.com. Now let's start. So open your Google Sites, then click on this settings option. Now on the left side click on custom domains. Now click on start setup. So I already have a custom domain. So select the first option. Use a domain from a third party. Then click on next. Now enter your domain name. So I will copy my domain name. I will paste it here. So as you can see this domain is not verified. Please verify your ownership. So click on this option to verify your ownership. Simply click on it. So this is Google Webmaster and you can see the line here. This tool is going away. Manage your verification tokens directly in the search console. So click on this search console to verify your ownership. One important thing, make sure you have login with the same Gmail account in your Google search console and your Google sites. Okay. Make sure you are using the same Gmail ID for both Google sites and Google search console. Now on the left side, add property, drag down and click on add property option. Now enter your domain name here. So I will copy my domain name and I will paste it here and click on continue. Verify domain ownership by DNS records and this is my domain name healthyandcaring.com. Instruction for GoDaddy already selected. Change it to any DNS provider. Now you have two records txt or cname so go for cname records now you have to add cname record in your godaddy dns records so open your godaddy page now click on dns scroll down and this is the dns records now you have to add a cname record here so i will show you how to do it copy the first cname record now open your godaddy page then click on add a new record in the type section select cname in the name column paste the first address now copy the second destination address paste it on the value section in the TTL select half an hour then click on save successfully added so this is my CNAME record successfully added now refresh your GoDaddy page that's it now go to search console click on verify ownership verified successfully then click on done now cut this tab google search console now click on cancel refresh your google sites again go to settings option click on custom domain start setup third party next now enter your domain name
and you can see the blue tick owner verification error has been removed now click on next now you have to add another CNAME record and these are the details copy this www now open GoDaddy page click on add a new record in the type section select CNAME in the name section paste www now copy the second address and paste it on the value column in the TTL select half an hour and click on save successfully added so as you can see this is my CNAME record added successfully now refresh your GoDaddy page always refresh your GoDaddy page when you add a new record in DNS records now go back to Google sites and click on done and you can see my domain name has been added successfully cut this window now click on this site link option and my new domain name has been added now I will copy my new link and I will try so the website is not live yet I have to wait for around one hour so I will pause this video so after waiting for 10 minutes now my domain name is live as you can see it's working fine I will show you again this is my domain URL and now my domain name is live as you can see now move on to a next step enable domain forwarding so open your GoDaddy page scroll down and you will get this forwarding option this is domain forwarding simply click on add forwarding now enter your full destination URL so copy from www and paste it here so this is my complete URL www.healthyandcaring.com so if someone try to enter my domain name without www this will redirect it to my full domain URL then click on save successfully save now refresh your GoDaddy page that's it I will refresh this URL and you can see so this is how you can connect your Google sites to a custom domain of GoDaddy so this is all for the video thank you thanks for watching tech fight have a nice day